and here during my senior speech. I still remember the day that I arrived as if it was yesterday. I must say, I did not have a great couple of weeks. First of all, I came two weeks late because I had problems with my visa. Rome probably thought I was never going to show up. A few days later, a few days after I finally showed up, I had my first team practice. I remember it was very hot and humid that day. I started hitting and after a couple of minutes, I was already out of breath. My face was bright red and my shirt was soaking wet. I was not used to this at all. All I was thinking at that time was to survive for another hour. 10 minutes later, I was sitting in the shade with a towel covering my head and ice on my neck. All I was thinking about was how to survive the next four years. <laughs> but it turned out pretty well. Um, I, have made, I have memories made for life and I'm grateful to have been a part of the program. I am so glad I made the decision to come to UF and be a Gator. A lot of people ask me what I will remember about my four years at UF. And the first thing that automatically pops into my head are the two national championships. Those are accomplishments that will stay with me for the rest of my life. But when I think about it more, the most important thing is the relationships I've built with people. My teammates, friends, coaches, and many more. That is why I want to thank some people. Kathy, first of all, I want to apologize for all the mistakes I've made in interviews. But I think I got better over time. <laughs> Thank you for having those interviews up on Gators Zone right away, even if we would finish late. You were always one of the last people leaving the tennis center after a match. Thank you for all your work. Kim Green, thank you for making sure we follow the rules and keeping, keeping us eligible. I also want to thank you for showing your support at our home matches. <clears throat> Tom, coming all the way from Belgium and being completely new in the school system, I was very fortunate to have you as my academic advisor and guide me through my four years. Scheduling classes, um, having to talk to professors, all your support made this process easier. Thank, thanks for the continued support. The boosters, I'm grateful to have had such big support from all of you. You have given me the chance to enjoy every single bit of my career as a Gator. I will miss playing in front of a big crowd and try to entertain you. Thank you for always being there to support us. Brooke, Tiff, and Marvel. I will miss having those massages almost every week. That was something we all look forward to after our matches. Thank you for giving the best, the best massages ever. <laughs> Kelsey, thank you for constantly telling us to stay hydrated, what to eat and what not to eat. I'm thankful you're looking out for us. Kate, you're the best director of tennis operations someone could wish for, and you're one of the hardest working people I've met. I'm, not, I'm going to miss seeing your smile every time I walk in the tennis center. I will also miss having a non-existent language with someone. Thank you for all, your work, all the work you do and always putting that smile on your face. Dr. Padilla, every time I see you, I think of that time where I fainted. Remember? <laughs> I must have made a great impression on you. Thank you for always being there when we need you. Tyler. It was always a journey in the weight room. We never knew what was coming, and you always surprised us, surprised us with those funny names you called us. I'm going to miss being entertained and to be called a fairy. Thank you for, <laughs> thank you for putting so much work into getting us stronger. Laura and Nas, it is great to learn from people that have experienced everything themselves. Thank you for helping us out with whatever we need. I could not imagine better volunteer assistant coaches than you guys. Mark, I don't know how you do it, but whenever my string would break, it would be magically restrung the next day, even though I would not see you the whole day. <laughs> thank, you for, <laughs> thank you for putting up with a bunch of girls that can be immature sometimes, and thanks for not judging me about the mess that I make in a locker room, because you're the one that spends the most time in there. <laughs> Kelly, you're one of the funniest and sweetest people I've met. Rehab and treatment was fun because of you. Thank you for being there for us 24-7 and for giving me your hair tie almost every day. I probably owe you 100 hair ties, which I eventually will give back to you. <laughs> Dave, when I first met you, I thought you had the coolest assistant coach in college, and I still haven't changed my mind. It has always been so easy to talk to you, and you've always been there for me and the rest of the team. I know we can annoy you with little things like asking for new clothes, but you always surprise us. Thank you for helping me on and off the court.
support. I'm glad I had you as my coach for these four years. Roland, I had not met someone that's more stubborn than me, other than my mom, but I think you come pretty close to her. <laughs> that is part of what makes you such a good coach, because you would never give up and always have that winner's mentality. You have helped me grow as a person, and I'm so thankful that you gave me the opportunity to play for you up. Thank you for putting up with me these four years. I know I'm not always easy to deal with. And lastly, I want to thank my team. Court. We have only spent one year together, but I'm grateful to have had you on my team. You were that person that would do anything for anyone. I'm going to miss you a lot. Belle, you are not only a great friend, but also a great doubles player. Let's shine these last few weeks. I will miss playing doubles with you and trying to imitate your accent, but hopefully we can play some more doubles matches in the future. Steph, you are the funniest person on earth. You would say things that don't even make sense, but it cracks everybody up. You can talk forever, so nobody ever gets bored. I will miss you heaps. <laughs> I think you are a mature one on the team. Even though you wouldn't say a whole lot, I know you can't mess with Bree. Don't ever lose that attitude. Alex, I don't even know where to start. We have been through so much together. I'm glad I could spend these four years with you. We have memories made that will last forever, just like our friendship. And lastly, Liv. We're scared to strive how much I'm going to miss you. It is going to be weird not seeing you every day. You have always been there for me, and hopefully that won't be any different when I leave. I'm glad to have known such a good friend in college. I might be on the other side of the ocean, but it does not mean our friendship stops here. Let's make these, let's make these last three weeks memorable. Thank you again and go Gators.